most intense competition shows on television, reserved for the physically elite. American Ninja Warriors pits the fittest of the fit against impossible obstacles. And now the American Ninja Warrior champions have banded together. USA versus the world in a battle royal in Las Vegas. With me today is hot shot of the USA team and Colorado guy, Ian Dory. Nice to see you, Ian. Yeah, thank, you, thank you for having me. Yeah, this is exciting. Yeah. USA, you guys have come a long way. Yes, we have. We trained super hard and we want to bring the trophy back for USA this time. I, I have a good feeling. I'm keeping my fingers crossed. You guys are excellent. But let's start with your journey. How did it all start for you? Well, my let's see. My, my background is in rock climbing. So that set me up to be a ninja warrior. And I met Brian Arnold, who was on the show, and he actually got me into it. So and we, we trained a bunch together, and I submitted an application, and they accepted me, which is really hard. And that was sort of the beginning. What was your application like? Was it a video? Yeah, so you have to fill out a, these big, long forms and then submit a video of why you'd be awesome on TV. So Very cool. And now, some of the biggest challenges that you go through, you mentioned you were a rock climber. Does it help? What's the toughest one that you have to deal with? Well, all of it's really challenging, it's but Dory, I think the, the, the upper Colorado. body stuff and, and just stringing it all together. So there's not one thing that's harder than the other, just doing it when it's game time. And now your entire team, you mentioned that you trained with some of your wolf pack that you call here in Colorado. Yeah, wolf pack, yep. And, and now they're all heading to Vegas or a few of the American Ninja Warriors going against the world. What do you think is going to be the toughest competition for you? Hmm, toughest competition, Pro probably Team Europe. Yeah. Uh, Sean McCall is amazingly strong and Stefano, they both climb crazy hard. Sean McCall, he's been in, he's a four-time world champion. Mm -hmm. So our work is cut out for us. <laughs> there, the course is just crazy. I look at it and you have to have not only upper body strength and, you know, leg strength, but finger strength, what you grasp onto. Absolutely. We train all the time. Actually, if you want to know exactly how we train, yeah. you can go to our website, www.wolfpackninjas.com and find out exactly what we do, our diets. And then also, if you want to know more, we have a podcast, Wolfpack Ninja Podcast, and you, you can find it on iTunes and on our website, and that'll come out February 2nd. Very nice. Now, the, the Wolfpack, you're part of that Colorado team. Were you all bonded together here in Colorado? Is that how it happened? Yeah, well, we're all rock climbers, and so we all kind of knew each other. Like, I knew Megan Martin from competitions, yeah. and then I met Noah Coffin, who's a big-time rock climber, through Ninja. So we're all just kind of uh, a big family, a ninja-slash-climbing family. And is there a female Wolfpack member? Yeah, Megan Martin, she's the she-wolf. The she-wolf? Yeah. I she love wolf, it. Yeah. Awesome. It's difficult for the, the course for a lot of women, but they have made it so far. Yeah, yeah, it's... Um, it's the same course that the men have to yeah, go through, it's the, right? It's the same course, same obstacles, so, you know, if there's a, they're a little shorter mm -hmm. or whatever, it's, it's you know, the, the same obstacle. They have to train just as hard as us, and actually, Megan, she's, she's amazing. She, yeah. she uh, does things that we can't do sometimes in training, so it pushes us, keeps our ego in check. <laughs> <laughs> and you mentioned hype. Do you find that the a majority of the American Ninja Warriors, are they like the average height, or are there some that are six foot or above? So just in the wolf pack, there's kind of that whole range. I'm 5'8", and Noah, he's like six foot really tall. And wow, doesn't that make it more difficult? I, I would say that sometimes it makes it more difficult, but sometimes it makes it easier, mm -hmm. like the spider jump. If you're too short, then it's hard to get the distance, but if you're too tall, you're actually kind of crammed in there. And it's So it, it helps to just be, I would say, average. Average, yeah. good. <laughs> but you are not average for sure because you're a professional rock climber and you're from Colorado, so does that add pressure? Do, do people expect, okay, he's going to kill this part? You know... Maybe a little bit, but mm -hmm. I've I've done lots of competitions. I'm very competitive, Good. so having that added pressure, I think, helps me perform better. And speaking of added pressure, you're a dad. You have a son. Totally. He's, how old is he now? He's a year and a half. Wow. Yeah. Is that going to make you slow down? Uh, no, I have to speed <laughs> up, actually. <You> do? <laughs> yeah, he's a little pistol. Hi, Pax. Dad's Pax? on TV. Aww, <laughs> that's cute. He's giving a shout out to Pax. Hey, thanks for watching, buddy. Yeah. Do you think he's going to follow in your footsteps? 
Probably, yeah. He likes to do everything that I do. So Well, I hate to embarrass you, especially since your son's watching, but I have my stopwatch here on my iPhone. And yeah, I can't do what you can do. But I thought, if you're a true warrior, let's see if you can do what I can do. <laughs> oh, Let great. me get my easy button here. Oh, nice. Buzzer. I can do this makeup routine 45 seconds. Are you ready to take the challenge, Ian Dory, <laughs> to do the Denise Plant makeup routine and see if you could do it in 45 seconds? Let's do it. All right. I love it. It's a competition. <laughs> we are going to start, my friend, with the foundation. Okay, foundation. Then you go to blush or rouge, then you go to powder. You can use the opposite side of that pad, and then you do your eyelashes. Just okay. top only, you don't have to worry about so bottom. So I use, do I do Let me put it in order. Foundation, you can use your fingers, whatever color you choose, just, rouge. rouge, yes. Okay. Powder and mascara. Are you ready, Ian Dory? <laughs> I'm ready, let's okay. do it. Okay, <laughs> clock, set, go! Okay. Okay, foundation. All over, buddy. Even your nose. Come on. Got to get the nose and the forehead. Let's do it. Rouge, next step. Oh, finger, finger. finger, finger, finger. You can look in the mirror if you want. Come on, it has to be pretty. <laughs> Very nice. Powder, powder. Other side. We're down to 17 seconds, ladies and gentlemen. Ian Dory oh, no. is cracking the world record of 45 seconds. You got to use... Uh, uh, you got to use a mirror. You got to oh. get it on your eyelashes. You cannot get it under your eyes. Ladies and gentlemen, oh, God, American eyes. Ninja Warrior Ian Dory cracks the record at 34 seconds. Oh, Woo! Nice. New world record. You're a champion. Wow. I'm and, not used to using a mirror to have to look and And can do I that. say you're a pretty man? <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be an epic battle for the title of American Ninja Warrior Champion. You got to watch USA versus the World this Sunday, January 31st at 7 p.m. only on 9 News. Follow Team USA on Twitter by using hashtag American Ninja Warrior.